we have an Ohio police officer that has admitted to fabricating a story to cover up what really happened. can only imagine that this happens more than people think. And in this instance, I think there's more to the story in the end than they're even saying here. Now, this whole story starts off with this Ohio police officer that was apparently shot. And he says he was shot by two armed suspects last week. He was chasing them in a black vehicle. They opened fire on him, and that's how he got his wound. Well, after doing a lot of interviews, none of the witnesses had seen this cop chasing anyone. They could find no one, no camera proof, no anything showing that that was the case. So, you know, they were cracking down on him, like, what really happened? And he said, okay, I did it. And they're like, what do you mean? He's like, I tried to commit suicide. And really, they were like, what? So they released this man, and he's in the care of his family. They're concerned about his mental health, obviously. And something just doesn't sit right about this story. Now, this just goes to show that anyone, any cop, doesn't matter who it is, can make up a story and try to blame someone else. They actually arrested one man, brought him in on the crime, and then had to clear him. I guess once it was admitted here that he shot himself. They tried to state he was committing suicide or tried to commit suicide. Who tries to commit suicide shooting themselves in the arm? Doesn't make any sense. I'm almost wondering if this guy shot himself in an attempt with this whole fabrication of, of chasing people to try to get some leave or something. I don't know. I'm not sure. But when the whole story seemed to fall apart, he just said that he tried to commit suicide. I'm sure they were asking the same questions. Did you really think you are going to kill yourself shooting yourself in the arm? So, the whole suicide excuse is kind of shaky. If you ask me, the whole story is, but bottom line, this cop admits to fabricating a shooting. Covering it all up, and some guys almost went down for it. Nonetheless, this man off the streets, thankfully. I'll leave a link with more information. It's been Dabu7.